to my YouTube channel, Steve of the Window Cleaner. Today I'm going to teach you how to clean screens for windows. And we're going to go over three different ways. The first way is super, super simple. You take a screen. Usually for professional window cleaners, or even if you're just cleaning your screens at home, you have some sort of bucket and it would work with like a sponge or a very wet towel. Put a little bit of Dawn soap in the bucket. I here have a microfiber sleeve. Sometimes we do this for jobs where there's maybe only a few screens. Take that soapy mop there. You could use a separate bucket or you could use a, the same bucket used to clean the windows depending on how dirty the windows or screens are. Just simply go over the front, the back here, a little along the frames. Take a big towel right here. Hit it a couple times not on the inside going out because you could possibly pop the rubber gasket but on the outside going in get some of that loose there and then just go over it with the towel at the end just to get the rest off cleaning your frames of the screen and simply that's it our screens aren't very dirty but we're putting them back in for the spring so that's why we're doing this and that always is suggest just setting them out. Don't set them against the garage or customer's house just in case they're leaving, but set them out in the sun to let them dry and do other work. Don't sit there and dry the screens all the whole time. So the next way is using a power washer. So this power washer goes up to 1600 PSI. Um, really it's safe for screens. We're not going too crazy with them. You want to keep it a good distance, but I'll show you what we do for those. Okay. Of course, our power washer is always leaking. So, this is probably the quickest way to do it. If you're at a job that has like 50 to 100 strings, I promise you, this is the quickest way to do it. So, you can hold it because this pressure washer is not enough where it's gonna hurt your skin or anything. Don't do direct contact, but it'll be okay. And you're just going to spray off the screen like so. Do the other side. And that's it for a screen. And you can literally just, again, let this sit out and dry. So our third way of cleaning the screens is the Aztec Innovation Screen Washer. This is also branded as the uh, Zero Screen Washer as well through Window Cleaning Resource. And basically what this is, is there's bristles here. I believe they're nylon bristles. And you're gonna bring the screen in and out of the bristles to clean the screen or up and down, either way you want. Now, the nice thing on here is that down here, there is kind of a valve on how high you want it or just to turn it on and off. If I turn it on, water starts coming through. If I go all the way, you see this a lot, but I can control it just right there if I don't want to bring a lot of water in and out and that's a good way sometimes it can get pretty messy and if you're doing like 50 to 100 screens you need to recollect it might be good to turn them off turn it off in between so that's a nice feature of the screen washer so you simply just move the screen in and out like this you can flip it if you want go from the top This, you'll get all those frames really clean. And when you have it like that at the end, just simply pop it on the concrete a couple times, very soft, but enough to get some of that water out and then just let that air dry. So out of all these three methods, what I would strongly suggest doing is using the pressure washer. I think overall it does the best job and it's the most quickest and efficient. The next is maybe a smaller thing like this with just the, um, bucket with water and soap especially for jobs that are smaller and you only have like five to ten screens that's a lot easier to do than set up everything and then the next would be the screen washer I would just be careful with that if you have broken screens or just being careful you don't break screens while you're doing it it is pretty tight in between the bristles that are going in and out but these are the three methods we use to clean um, screens for windows and I hope this has helped you if you have any questions comment below and I'll try my best to help you out have a good day bye bye